If you've been on the ChatGPT subreddit recently, there's a new style of image memes that are going around and it's getting Dolly 3 to create something that gets progressively more and more extreme. So I'll run through a few examples here. This is the first one. This is ChatGPT trying to make a bodybuilder progressively more muscular. So this is the first one, pretty muscular, more muscular. This person's probably winning a bodybuilding show. This person has won a bunch of bodybuilding shows. This person is probably the perfect specimen. And then this guy is a croissant, all filled with muscles. Let's do one more example. This is a typical European image. And in each image, it gets even more European. So this is the first one. You got the Eiffel Tower, the Colosseums. All right, here are all the European flags. Somehow the Statue of Liberty is in this one. The Eiffel Tower. This looks like a peace convention amongst all the European countries. <laughs> I like the phone booth just sitting here, like a Times Square. What is going on in this one? Got some flying mythical creatures and it's just filled with European stuff. <laughs> you got the food at the bottom here. Looks like a Colosseum, a river moat around. It's starting to get galactic. And we got like a space vortex sucking in the Leaning Tower of Pisa. And then Europe, if it was like an entire planet in the galaxy. So some of these are pretty cool. You can have a lot of fun with this. So I made a custom GPT that does exactly this. All right, I call it progressively GPT. And its profile picture is a burger because this is a joke GPT. It creates a series of images, each progressively amplifying a specific theme or characteristic. So let's try it out. Let's do a man who loves too much. And what the custom GPT is going to do, it's gonna create an image of this prompt. And then in each subsequent image, it's gonna make the man love even more. So it's gonna take a central theme from your prompt and make it more extreme. Let's see what it comes up with. Ah, oh, very cute. A man is holding a picture of him and a woman and he is smiling. Let's see what happens when this man loves even more. Okay, now this guy is becoming a little obsessed. He has a bunch of pictures of him and looks like his wife on the wall behind him. All right, the third image is he has his girlfriend or wife on a pillow and it looks like he's in love with all of his friends. All of his friends are plastered all over on the wall. Can he love even more than that? Yes, he can. <laughs> he has now created a bunch of figurines and statues of the people he loves most. And everyone is in the picture frames. And finally, his entire house is completely filled with the people he loves and it's taken over his entire life. This man went from a healthy love to an unhealthy obsession. All right, let's do another one. Let's do a hockey fan that gets more engrossed in the game. So I'm hoping this fan starts out as a casual fan and then he increasingly gets more into the game and his favorite team. Okay, the first picture is a man and he's sitting on the couch and he's holding a plant. I don't understand that, but he is watching the hockey game on TV. You know, he's wearing a jersey, he's enjoying the game. Second image, now he has his face painted and he's at home. He's got his jerseys hung on the wall. That's cool that they actually did the Chicago Blackhawks logo. I like that. Game's on TV. You know, he's really into it. All right, now this is an Oilers fan. His room is filled with televisions. He's watching a different game on every TV. He's got the Edmonton Oiler pillows. Now he's dressed as a hockey goalie. He's watching the games dressed up as a hockey player. And then the final image, his whole room is now a skating ring and he's playing virtual reality hockey. This man is far gone. We will not get him back. He loves the game way too much. Okay, that was Progressively GPT, a new custom GPT. This is a fun one. We're using Dolly 3 and it's completely free. I'm gonna drop a link to use this in the description below. I'm gonna add a few prompts here to get you going, just to get you some ideas. But have some fun with it, play around, and maybe show us in the comments below the fun things that you came up with using this custom GPT.